I've got staff coming in later. Oh, yes. I mean, I love working. I know. I it's, love my work. It seems like it. I'll finish my coffee. And I love people. Yeah, you, don't, well, you work around the way you want. If you're going to go to the do some photography, you go for it. I'm going to go do it, then I'll come back. Because it's quite amazing, that woodland. You carry on going. Find the spot. We own it. You can walk anywhere there. We own it. Okay, thank you. Uh, if you see some batches there, they will, you might see them today, but you only see the back end of them. Yes, okay. You see the fat asses going like this, just the arse end. Because <laughs> uh, they're just breathing. Right, right. Okay. But it will come out this time of the day. It's quiet down there. Fine, fine. I'll, I'll have a look. Um, I will, I will, of course. Oh, amazing. Amazing. So, so that was Stefan, um, who I just met, um, and he owns this, this pub, private, um, private house estate around in Snowdon. It's called, uh, this. I'm not going to try and pronounce it, but he has a beautiful house, as you have seen, um, and he gave me a, a beautiful tour around it. Look at all this stuff that he has. Wow. Amazing. That is all the way here so what I'm gonna do is go and see his private forest which he's kind kindly allowed me to do um, and go and see and uh, next time I do come to Snowdonia I will be contacting this gentleman to stay at this beautiful estate amazing all right, so um, I'm gonna start exploring this uh, little woodlands that Stefan has in his in his garden. <coughs> oh, let's see this. <coughs> so he said that uh, we might see badgers. Um, because it's mating season for them, and uh, he said they won't bother me, so um, I won't bother them. So, yeah, I will update you when I get to somewhere where I can start filming uh, with the drone and get some real nice shots uh, for the channel, okay? Let's go. <clears throat> All right, so I must point out that uh, Stefan, when he was speaking to me, he did say that there's if I keep following this route, I will come up to a, uh, a castle and he said it's quite hidden. So I'm intrigued to see where this, where this is. Um, so if I keep following this route here, um, I'm going to come up to a main road, which I have to cross. He said there'll be a hotel on my left. And then um, I've got to keep following it. And I think he said 60 seconds or something and I'll uh, something about 60 seconds and then I'll see some some castle um, so I'm, I'm quite <clears throat> I'm quite intrigued to see where this is um, this whole area just looks so beautiful and it's so it's so hidden um, so the Lamberis path is around to my left and uh, the forest is just a bit to the right but it's up on a hill um, as you can see, it's, it's, uh, it's quite beautiful and no one's here. Um, he says he owns this land, which is amazing. He says he owns 40 acres around Snowdonia, which is, which I find is, is pretty crazy. Snowdonia is a beautiful place and I, I love coming here. Um, so let's see what this, uh, forest, um, brings me. Right, so I've come in near the, the end of the trail. Um, it's the, the main roads down there. There's some people camping around here, but it's, it's a beautiful woodlands. Absolutely beautiful. Um, and I'm excited to have a look at this castle that uh, Stefan has kindly told me about. It's 
let's go and see. All right, so I'm just across the road. Um, and I have found this path. I think this might be it. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna, just, I'm gonna follow this path and hopefully it will leave, lead me to the, I think he's had 60 seconds from the start. So, uh, it's about 12.14 now. Hopefully I'll get there in a minute. Let's see. All right, so the castle is in sight. Um, about two minutes in. About two minutes in, I think you can see right there. Oh, I'm excited now. It looks, looks amazing now. It's bigger than I thought it would be. Um, so yeah, let's see, let's see um, what it's like up there. There it is. Okay, so we have made it to the castle. There it is. Hopefully I can get up and get some great uh, drone shots. Ooh, I'm excited. It looks good. Okay, so this is very cool. There's some stairs up here, which I'm gonna go up soon. Looks like a little ritual place. Right, so this is the top. It's got this this chain um, gate around it, which so people don't climb um, and fall fall down. And yes, look at this. It's very cool, but I wanted to fly my drone off um, up here, but obviously I can't now um, because of this. But what I might do is uh, go down and then take it off from outside and then get a nice little um, little shot of this this castle. But oh my God, Stefan, you have uh, shown me a nice little Nice little location, nice little hidden gem in Snowdonia, so thank you, if you're watching this. So cool. See some of the peaks, right there. Amazing. Amazing. Right, so, I'm gonna head down now, and uh, wish me luck, because it's quite steep. I'm gonna take each step very carefully because I don't want to fall down. Oh god, it's quite tight in here, I must say. <sighs> yep, you see how tight it is. I don't know if, how the camera is performing, but it's very tight. Then you have this little spots, which is quite cool. Then you have all these spots. All right, I'm gonna stop filming now and focus on getting down, and then I'll get some drone shots. 
Oh, so I made it down safely, which is good. Uh, yeah, looks very cool. Oh, so this is like what it's outside. These steps are cool. Okay, so I'm going to set up or sit down there and then get the drone in the air. Oh, I can't wait for this. It's going to be cool. Right, so I'm getting the drone ready. Right, let's get this in the air. fantastic footage of this castle yeah um i'm about to head um, back but i'm just just look at this view it's magnificent you don't get this down south the south of england it's all flat down there i mean that's why i love coming here it's it's just so 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 amazing looking at all this 